Do you need some advice for, I don't know, I hope you don't have too much drama in your life? Well, just <laughs> enough, though, because we asked the woman who will dish it out to you, talk show host and New York Times best-selling author, I don't know how many times over, Wendy Williams is here now in the studio to talk about her latest book, Ask Wendy, which is full of all kinds of stuff that people have asked it's you about. It's practical advice, Robin, for yeah. all the drama in your life. Thank you for having me. Thanks for being up early and being on. I'm we appreciate it. We appreciate it yes. so much. She gets up at 5.30 for her show anyway. We're so. live out of New York at 10. What are they doing this week without you? Well, Fridays we tape on Thursday. It's a cheat day. Okay. So I'm able to do things like this. You know, in my world, a cheat day is diet. Speaking of which, I'm you look amazing. How did you do it? I'm about to cheat downstairs. <laughs> I saw Chick-fil-A in the CNN uh, food court. <laughs> or it might be Arby's. I'm not sure. But you know what? It took a year. Uh -huh. And I, I lost 20 pounds, which, you know, isn't a, a monumental amount of weight. But sometimes you just need a tweak before swimsuit season starts. <laughs> was, it, was it the Slim Jims? Did you quit that a long time ago? Oh, yeah. I changed uh, turkey jerky. Turkey you know, jerky? You know I like my jerked meat. I did not know. Turkey jerky <laughs> with hot sauce is so good. Uh, and you can get it gluten-free and all that. I'm not gluten-free. I'm not into all that. But they say it's bad for you. When, when her talk show first started, it's been four seasons now. Yeah. Um, like the talk soup and everybody would go like, Wendy Williams took a lighter to a slam jam. And, and so now you went the skinny route. Yeah, well, you know, <laughs> jerky, you just have to swap things out. And that's basically what I did. Yeah. You know, you swap things out for things that are less calories. You step up a little bit of gym routine and you lose the 20 pounds. But this is the fourth season of the show and I wanted to look you look amazing. Thanks. You look amazing. Uh, <laughs> Spackle. <laughs> smoke and mirrors. Smoke and mirrors. Okay, let's talk about the book here. Um, this book, people ask questions and then she gives advice. For example, when is honesty not the best policy? Do tell. If nobody asks for your opinion. <laughs> and also, even when they ask for your opinion, what I find, and you might find this, the older you get, the more you know how to swap out one word for the other and make it sound nicer. So you become a diplomat. Bless your heart. Yes, those jeans do make your butt look big. But, but, but there's a brand called Not Your Daughter's Jeans, and they would probably be better than getting your jeans at BB. Mom, you're 62. <laughs> So really, you did say... A choice of words. I like that. Yeah, a better choice of words. And, um, and this book, Robin, was made up of people writing me letters, Wendy Watchers, and I'm answering them. I like that. Yeah. We, we do have some from our viewers as okay, well. Okay, good. But that's going to come up in the next segment here. Um, in addition to everything that you're doing, uh, you've done radio and you've done television. Now you're about to go on Broadway in the... In Chicago? Yeah. Not the Chicago the town, but Chicago the, the musical? Chicago on Broadway. Do you sing? Do you dance? No. Well, I was on Dancing with the Stars. I was eliminated second, so clearly I don't dance. <laughs> but, and, and singing, um, right now my favorite uh, song in the shower and in the car is uh, May Matron Mama Morton's song, which is the character You're that I'm playing, him. Be Good to Mama. Okay. And Mama! You know, Good, you got the listen, growl. Exactly, because you know what? It's a, it, Matron Mama is about being sassy and having a little attitude. It's not really about singing operatic. Yeah. People who've played her in the past include Queen Latifah and also Sofia Vergara. Two totally different people, but they, they captured yeah. the role. So hopefully I'll yeah. do the same. I have seven weeks on Broadway, beginning yeah, June, tw uh, June 25th. While doing your show? Yeah. I like to be busy as long as I have cooperation at home. Okay, let me, let me tell you, I'm going to give you a taste of what some of our viewers want to know. Okay. And that will be after this, but someone says, I'm struggling to create my social circle. What do I do? Hold it, hold it. We'll be right back. Even at 7.47 in the morning, Wendy Williams is awake and fun. Now, she's talking about her new book called Ask Wendy. You are asking her. Crystal, your fellow viewer, said, My daughter is seven years old and has two older cousins who are 9 and 11. They bully her quite a bit. The parents do nothing. What can I do? So it's family. Okay, this is, would be in the family drama chapter in my book. Um, a quickly, a sit down with mom. E even more so than dad, because moms tend to be a little bit more compassionate. Um, sit down with the, with the mother and talk about this. And don't, don't smile. This is not a joke. Bullying can get serious, and it starts with home. And these are her cousins. Yeah, just right? address it instead of 
talking around it, right? Yes. Um, Josh says, hi, Wendy. I'm new to New York City by way of Arkansas, struggling to create my social circle. Got any suggestions? Yes, Josh. Um, there's a saying that um, I was taught years ago when I was a kid. It's called travel light, travel far. When you go out, when you want to make your way, whether it's your socially networking or networking for the purpose of your career, leave all your friends and all the, the people in your ears behind you. Walk in the room by yourself, in this case, to the local bar, to the local TGI Fridays or wherever you're going to go. Set up shop by yourself. Get out there. You're in New York City. The world is your oyster. Get out there and make it happen. You got it. Okay, so um, let's play. Let's play a game with Wendy. We'll call it one word or one sentence. Okay. One word, I guess, with Wendy because okay. of time. So I'll give you a subject and then you can, I think you can do one sentence. If okay. You, you ready? First up, Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. I know you're crazy about this subject. Co-parenting, single mom. Oh, interesting. Okay, how about... Uh, I don't think it's going to take you long to figure out who this is. Watch. I meet my McDonald's. I uh, come outside. I see this girl going nuts trying to get out of her house. Charles so Ramsey. Uh, the media went crazy for him. He was so um, animated when he helped women in Cleveland who were in a house for 10 years yes. get free. Yes. Ready One word? Oh. Bless his heart. <laughs> <laughs> read between the lines, but bless his heart. How about Reese Witherspoon? Because you remember Reese, um, she was arrested recently. Poor little Reese. Um, basically, she said, uh, do you know my name? Because you're going to know my name. <laughs> Drunk, otherwise nice girl. I she didn't so mean that. She wasn't trying to be shady. She just, that's not the thing you yeah. say, Robin. When's the last time you said that? Never. I, if, you know what? I said I was impressed that she didn't curse. Yeah. There were no curse words. Yeah, Reese had drinks. I like, it makes me look at her as a more human, yeah. like, like the rest of us. And she apologized. She owned it. Yeah. So the book is called Ask Wendy. You'll see. You can ask her anything. What's, what, what, are, what are people not allowed to ask you? Anything that you can ask anything. Honestly, I, I I don't I don't have an answer for everything. If I don't have the answer, I'll be honest with you and tell you. But I'm an open book, and I won't giggle at your problems. What are your Twitter? What is your Twitter handle so people can ask Wendy if they want to? Is it, I think it's just Wendy Williams. Yes, I follow yeah, you. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I saw her face go. I don't know. I just pressed. No, the you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back. Oh no, we're gonna talk to Jennifer. Sorry about that. <laughs>